Hi, welcome to Rosie's Way. Guess what we're doing today? I'm not telling you, it's a secret. Come on, get your running shoes, your walking shoes. Get something that you can sweat in. And guess what we're gonna do today? I haven't done it in over 20 years. Come on with me. Welcome. As you can see, I've got my sweat towel with me. And no, I'm not taking you to the gym. You know, you know, I'm not gonna do that to you today. I'm gonna take you some, okay. You know what? I hope I can find one. That's my issue right now. You see how I have my little cute sweatband on? Yeah, it's not for the gym. Um, I should be able to find one. Can you figure out what I'm gonna have to go search for first? Figure it out. If you figure it out before I show you, then I send you, I send you an air hug. <laughs> How's that? It's such a beautiful day outside today. And, uh, I missed you guys. I missed you guys, you know? I've been getting a few comments here and there, which I need more. I need more. I hope you have gone to uh, visit me on um, Instagram, which is Roses Red 2006. Uh, you know my YouTube channel is Rosie's Way, uh, which is at, at Rosie's Way 1619. I think if you, you do it through, if you don't do the link, but there's a link there in my Instagram. There's a link in my Facebook for my GoFundMe page for my uh, charity and uh, nonprofit uh, organization to build the school and to build the senior citizens, uh, you know, it's a, it'll be joint, you know, so the kids can come and the senior citizens with no one who care for them or no family or ones who just want to get out and just play cards and sit and have tea and socialize with the younger people or people of their age. We want to, you know, we want to create that. Um, so we've got Rosie's Way for my YouTube. Roses Red 2006 for my Instagram. And if you want to find me on Facebook, it's Rose Marie, all one word, Peart Seraphin, right? Just, it's there, all the links are there. You don't even have to type it in, just click the links. And for my foundation, Chambers Hope Haiti Missionary, click the link, learn all about us and just, you know, come along for the journey. But it's good to see you. Now hold on to your hats. We say that in English, hold on to your hats, even if you're not wearing one and go like this. Because you're going to laugh at me in about a few minutes, okay? No problem though, no problem. See, I might be adventurous, but I'm not crazy. With this heat and with this, what I'm going to try in a few minutes, I need some nourishment. I need some refreshment. I need my towel. Yeah. So let's go get some water first and then continue on our little hike to get where we have to get, okay? I'm going to stop here to get some water, maybe some, no, I gotta stop drinking the um, apple juice and the cider, cause it's hurting my stomach. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Good, I'm looking, where's your water? Water just on the right. Okay. Mmm, Perrier. <laughs> I haven't had that in a while. Let's get some of that. It's still water, it's just bougie. Relax. Let's get some Perrier. Okay, we got Perrier. All right, what's what we're gonna get? It's refreshing. Get some gas bubbles out of you. It's all good. So I got the Perrier. Oh, oh, there it is. I got the Perrier. It's so awkward holding it with one hand and trying to turn the bottle. There it is. I should have went the other way, but still, this will be my refreshment. Like I said, get ready. This is going to be hilarious. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself already. What do you mean? You got to laugh at yourself sometimes, you know? And you got to try things you haven't tried in years. And for me, this is, this is like, hoo, 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 nerve wracking, but yet exciting. So we're almost there. We're almost there. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We're going, we got the daycare over here. It's such a cute, I like the, the little art they do on the building. Oh, to be young again, but not that young. See, that's the daycare name there. Uh, 
This is a nice neighborhood, my neighborhood. Oh yeah, remember I was telling you about that pear tree? Watch a few blogs, maybe five blogs before. And you remember that pear tree I told you about? And the people don't even eat the pear and the pears are the size of your hands and they hang down to the front lawn. This is the tree. This is the tree. Watch in about three weeks, four weeks, pears will be hanging down. But this time I'm gonna go talk to the owner because nobody eats them and see if I can pick some, you know? It's gonna be exciting, it's gonna be fun, and they're delicious. I mean, the ones I find on the other tree are delicious. I haven't tasted this one yet, but they look delicious. So I'm gonna show you like the only, only, well, Jamaican, West Indian place in this whole village. Yeah, you've got Haitian, but we're, Jamaicans are, different we have our certain foods it's totally different from Haitian food completely different I mean we use onions we use that but not the spices not the way we season our food it's different from Haitian if you've never tried Jamaican food before go try it but I was trying to tell you this is the only Jamaican store bakery that is in this village of St. Michelle and the owners are really nice I don't think they're open today he makes, see the bread? He makes the, the bakeries in the back and he makes the fresh Jamaican bread. And he has patties also. See the hard dough bread at the back there? I don't know if you can see it because I'm at the window. He bakes all that. This, this family is really nice. And they're on, uh, what street is this? On D. Beville and La I don't know if you can see that. Let me zoom in there. And then this store here, they bake Jamaican bread. They have patties, juices, Jamaican cake, black cake. Like I said, it's the only Jamaican shop in St. Michelle or in the near area. Oh, I wish there was more. Maybe I'll just open one myself. If I open a food truck, a Jamaican food truck, boy, man. I'd be making a killing. I met a lot of people like, you're Jamaican. I said, yeah, I was Jamaican born. I know how to cook Jamaican. I cook Jamaican food all the time. I was Canadian raised in Ontario, but I'm Jamaican through and through when it comes to, you know, my history, my food, my attitude. <laughs> but uh, it'd be cool if I opened a, a Jamaican food truck. Huh, hmm, let me pray on that. Let me give it to God and see what he tells me. You never know, you never know. Look at this beauty. I'm sitting here yapping, but I'm still searching for what? The surprise. Oh, look at that, look at those are apple trees in the backyard. Ooh, but you see that branch that hangs over? Apple falls on this side of the fence. It's free game, free game, free game. Just saying, just saying. <laughs> Listen, if the apple is on this part and you own that part, that I can eat the apple on this part, right? Right? Okay. No, we're having a sun shower. We're having a sun shower. Oh, I love it though. I love it. But I gotta go find what I'm looking for. Oh. And if I don't find it on this outing, I will though, I will. I have to. Ah, oh, see, we're having a sun shower. I don't, oh, oh, it's coming down. It's coming down. Can you see it? Can you see it? Oh, I'm not giving up. I'm gonna go search. I'm staying out here. I'm staying out here. Oh, ho, ho. Woo -wee. <laughs> so yeah, I am so ghetto. I'm not going back. I'm I'm gonna continue searching for what you like my hat. You like my hat. <laughs> I'm gonna continue searching through this sun shower and find what I need to find. Why is it I can see them all the time when I'm not prepared to do it? But now that I've built up the energy, you know, and say, I'm gonna do it, I can't find them. Have you figured out what it is yet? But you know what? I was supposed to head up this way and, ooh, ooh, no, no. I was supposed to head up this way anyways to, uh, to come and show you this also today, but I was supposed to do it with a something special. But right now, I'm still on foot and I'm getting wet. So I'm gonna show you this part and then we'll continue searching for what I need to find, you and I need to find. <laughs> this is a cool rain hat though, don't you think? 
so cute. <laughs> I bet you think you're on a TV set of some space movie. Do you think, okay, okay, here, read this. It says that walk is 28 minutes that way. But you go on this side. Can you see that? Was it? You're not on a space set. You're not on a different planet. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Let me zoom in. Hey, hey. can you guess what these are? And no, they're not big golf balls. <laughs> guess, guess, guess. Leave what you think it is in the comment box. Okay, I'm going to go a little closer. Really close. But let me zoom out first. Can you figure out what it is? Doo -doo -doo. There's tons of these pods all over. Oh, look at this rainbow, guys. Wait, can you see it? God is good all the time, all the time. God is good. Look at that. Okay, I'm going to try and zoom in some more. Can you see that? Well, maybe I should zoom out so you can see it better. Hold on, come on. Can you see the rainbow? Yes, man. Yes. Ooh. So pretty. So pretty. All right, now let's go back to what these are. Have you figured it out yet? Huh? Now, which side should we go up on? Let's go on this side, you know? Maybe I'll be able to see. Oh, 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 did I find them? Did I find it? Oh, is it, oh, oh, I'm getting excited, I'm getting excited. No, it's not them. Oh, man. Okay, back to over here. All right, I kind of like, okay, yeah, you know, have to be careful because I got those bum knees and I mean that with all love but I'm not foolish enough to think I'm 20 to try to <laughs> hike this at a rapid pace I'm taking my time I'm the turtle I'm the what do you call it the tur tortoise and the hare and the hare was really quick well I'm the tortoise I get there when I get there I arrive and I enjoy it I rest a little I turn around and I go back and search for new adventures. You, yeah. oh, look at this. Hello, earth calling, earth calling. What is this? What is this? <laughs> You've landed on planet Rose. <laughs> Don't mind my crazy sense of humor. You gotta live in love and love and have faith. And like I said, it's not huge golf balls. <laughs> it's not, it's not. Okay. All right. We got the numbers on here. This is your spaceship number and your flight, flight time. No, I'm just kidding, it's not. <laughs> does this one have a door? Yes, it does. Okay. Okay, and we got our speaker system here. Uh huh, uh huh. I think it is. And bam, what is it? What are these? Come on, what are these? And they're all like that. Okay, and let's break it down. You're in the middle of a ginormous humongous field right nothing is built around it look look how far before you get to the mining area down there I'll go down there closer in a little bit 
But what do you think these are? Let's figure out the clues. There's no buildings near it. As you can see for yourself, we're surrounded by grass, grass and forestry. Forestry. <laughs> forestry. A natural walking park, nature. But no buildings, no technical stuff, no towers. What, what do you think this is? And why? As far as the eye can see. Come on, do the trivia with me. Give me the answer. Because I'm going to make you wait. <laughs> All right, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm a little tired. <laughs> Not like physically like tired. It's just like, I'm still searching for these things, man. And you know what's going to happen? I'll have to go into part two because I'll get it. I start like, okay, I'll, I'll look for it later. And then I'll, bam, there it is. So... I didn't uh, capture me walking far. Oh, my dread's everywhere. I didn't capture me walking far on this because, you know, I didn't want to waste the precious moments with you. I caught a few minutes of me walking, but I had to walk far. I, I'm, I'm not playing with you. I had to walk far. So let me get my Perrier, my Perrier, my bougie water and take a sip. Because I'm dehydrated. That's why I'm drinking it. <laughs> and I'm still searching. Oh, Lord, you are amazing. But I'm here. Have you figured out what it is? Let, let, let's have a little talk. So how have you been? You all right? You may have a rough few days like me. Or maybe it's been smooth sailing. But you know what? Smile. Smile, because you get to talk with me. No, just smile, because you woke up this morning. No matter what we're going through. You woke up this morning and just say thank god now you pray for me you pray for me to find this stuff that i need to show you because it's going to be hilarious and cute supplies for you but i'm not giving up i'm gonna take another sip of this perry i'm gonna get back up on my feet and i'm gonna keep walking meanwhile you try to figure out what these huge size balls in the middle of an open area with a quarry is let me know okay oh yeah forgot to tell you it's saint michel if you want to come and do an outside adventure and just walk there's a beautiful beautiful uh hiking trails and walking trails there's fountains there's uh fountains for your dogs um cats whatever animal you're carrying benches to sit every maybe 200 meters um there's bathrooms um it's very clean you're getting the fresh air and the fresh breeze and look at me taking the heavens there you go i'll do it again look at them clouds hey hey look at that look at that and you saw my rainbow earlier but here we go here so if you if you okay i'm gonna zoom in see that gentleman walking there he's following the trails and i think these trails go like i don't want to lie i'm gonna find a sign that tells you how long the whole trail is and that's when i'll give you the answer of where i am and what these are right so again not golf balls not volleyballs not eggs even though they look at and know you're not on a different planet and you see <laughs> they don't get really good you see the, that's your shade isn't that cool though isn't it you know you can relax read a book fall asleep it's really cool and it's something for the environment see it all the way down there there's people on bikes and hiking and just enjoying enjoying i love nature i'm a nature woman fully fully i'm not a concrete jungle city walking on the cement kind of girl no put me out in the forest give me some snacks and some water and i'm good to go hmm hmm you see what i see hmm i'm gonna find you i'm gonna find you the man's looking at me like what 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 who who <laughs> 
And I hope you all realize we're surrounded by mountains. You know, in this area of, of Quebec, Montreal, Quebec, we are surrounded by mountains and I love it. See, that's a big mountain back there. You see it behind those buildings? I'd like to point, I should get one of those pointers instead of sticking my finger in the, in the shot, but you can see it, okay? You see it, if I pull back, you'll see it better. You see the mountains now? Well, there's higher than that. There's higher than that. And we're also, I'm gonna go up, see the plane? We're a, a plane highway. Um, let me explain what that is. There's an airport way over there where that plane's going. We actually have two airports in Montreal. But this is like on a regular road, you have lanes and on the highway or on the road, the dividers. This literally, oh, I'm showing the sky part, is a plane highway, it's a plane road, if that makes sense. They come through here every few minutes, heading towards the airport way over there. Can you see the plane? It's in the clouds. All right? So it's called the plane highway. Because the way that um, it goes, it's just like a road, it's like a map, but for the pilots. The pilots have their, their map with roadways on it too. But in their case, airways. And they have to do that so they avoid confusion, accidents, collisions, you know, things like that. That's why I respect pilots to the fullest, man. Oh, I had years ago, I had um, a childhood friend and give out a shout out to the Brent Salos. Hey, it's been years. And I think it was his dad that was a pilot. And then I went to a school with a girl named Heather. She became a pilot. And I mean, you have to have the highest Mac numbers. You gotta be good with all that. What is it? Calculus, geometry, math, trigonometry. What else? Everything else that I missed, everybody leave it in the comment box. In order to be able to fly a plane. Oh yeah, look at the butterflies. Look, 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 look. There's a butterfly um, sanctuary in here too. If I can find, oh, they're everywhere. Here, let me zoom in. Let me zoom in. See if I can get them. Can you see them? Yeah, oh, look, 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 look. Yeah, there's a butterfly sanctuary here. So come spring, come the, now, look at all of them. You'll see beautiful ones, huge ones, huge ones. And uh, I was saying, so to be able to be a pilot, you need discipline, you need intelligence, you need patience, and you need to do a lot of studying. <laughs> oh man, what a beautiful day. See my village, can you see it? There's a church there. There's a church on almost every block. Sometimes two churches. Saint Michel. What's that part of the accent when I say it? Saint Michel. <laughs> when I first moved here a few years ago, I was like, Saint Michael. <laughs> like, I would just forget about trying to say it right. And, oh boy. And that's my issue now. I've been at the University of Montreal first and then Sherbrooke and uh, learning the French language, trying to perfect it. And then guess what? I go and get a job <laughs> with people who want to speak English instead of French. And guess who is struggling again to, uh, you know, practice her French and use it. So I'm with my coworkers. I'm like, please just speak French to me, please, please. They're like, okay, Rose, okay. So I'll be like, uh, for example, quel numéro s'il vous plaît, right? And they'll be like, well, my number is, I'm like, no, 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 no. Answer me in French. They're like, Rose. <laughs> but I love it, I love it. And it's in the back of this old head, it is. It's just a lot of times I get so nervous and in the spur of the moment, I speak English. And that's something I gotta kick myself for and stop doing. Because it's there, it's there. And then you, sometimes you just get English uh, insecure because you don't want to sound like you're trying to put on this false um, accent and people looking at you like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay, all right, we see you, we see you. Oh, look at, look at, okay, look at all these butterflies. And there's a lot of these roots in here that you can make tea from. 
you can eat. Okay, for example, you see this here? This yellow, let me find it for you. This yellow one here, that's called a dandelion. For us, it's a weed, like a weed. A root. You rip them out, you throw them away. But would you believe in the grocery stores? They sell these for so expensive. In the health food stores, they sell these for so expensive. But you can go get them yourself. We make salad out of them and healing herbs. But you got to get the ones that have not been sprayed by pesticides and stuff. So you got to go out in the middle of bush, in the middle of nowhere, where they don't spray. And it's organic. Those have been known to heal, uh, uh, what is it? Prostate cancer. Um, to help with other forms of cancer, liver cancer. You know, to drink this, it, it for some what they from researching it for many years, it kills the cells. And this is what we considered a bush, a weed, and we toss it away. Um, a lot of Italians and Portuguese, and myself, <laughs> myself, a Jamaican. Not all Jamaican eat this, but we eat this. We put it up with onions and garlic, and uh, some seasoning, and some spices, and we either steam it or we saute it with some olive oil and whatnot and we eat it. It's so good. Or you can have it in a salad. Now, don't get me wrong, it's bitter. You eat it right from the stalk, it's bitter. The stems are bitter. But if you know how to cook it properly or make a salad of it properly, it tastes really good. It tastes really good. And here, you know, tell me if you have these in your country. When we were kids, we used to sit in the field and blow on these. Watch, okay, I'm gonna blow, watch, here it comes. Can you see it? Oh no. There it goes. <laughs> yeah. The birds drop the little seeds here, so different flowers grow from all over the place. But in this sanctuary, there's see there's birds, butterflies, different little critters running around. Yeah, man, this is beauty. Look at that. How much vegetables are in there? Oh. Oh. There's even wild strawberry, blueberry, raspberry bushes that you can make juice out of or just eat them. But you got to know the right ones to pick. You can't just go, oh, there's a berry. Mm -mm. No. Because sometimes you'll get a bird berry. Ew. Ew. <laughs> but look at that. Another plane. Going through the plane highway. Remember, you just saw one a few minutes ago. Same pattern. Do you see what I mean? Now I'm still walking through Rosie's planet. <laughs> what is it? Every so many meters, you see these little gadgets like that. And then, uh, they're gonna, there's one coming up that's in blue over there. Told you. And it's in blue. See, I told you every 100, 200 meters, there's benches. Yes, man, rest up and walk. Rest up and walk. See, there's another blue one. I don't wanna go into too close. Hmm. Yeah, don't ask me. Oh, oh. You can eat these too, right there, right there. Right there. See? And there goes another one. I like watching these at night because all the lights light up at the back in different colors for the different countries. So cool. So this is the facility. Okay, so I'm getting closer, but there's a fence. Now, if you go over here, there's more of a facility there. It's all fenced up. Hmm. But they put a natural nature park around it. And they have these pods of piping. That facility up there, you can't get near it. And that's a continuation of it. Hmm. Interesting. See, you go from this angle here. Right? 
And I like the fact that it's graveled pathways. You know, when you get the tarmac, it's so hard on your joints and your knees. See, there's more of those pipelines here. I know you figured out what it is already. Come on, tell me, tell me. Oh, look at that. There's that, that facility. Mm -hmm. Now you, you come around the bend and this is what you see. You hit a valley. See the valley? Now it dips down into the valley there. Oh, there goes another plane. Hopefully this means I'll be on a journey soon. I'll be able to go do missions overseas soon by God's grace. Oh, let me pray on it. Let me pray on it. I can write it with a pencil, but I give God the eraser. Hallelujah. So we get into this valley here. And they've got picnic tables. They've got those really cool, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Oh, good no, Lord, I just, you know what I mean. Protect you from the sun when you sit down. What is going on with me? It's like a canopy thing, but they have like a, a disc over your head. It's a disc here. See, they're all discs. And you can sit there and have a picnic or just hang out and relax. And if you, I'll get closer for you. It's uh, solar. Everything here is solar powered. And keep in mind, this is all free. This is all free. You know, you just have to respect. No dumping garbage, no, you know, just respect the land. And uh, yeah, so I'm wondering if there's charging stations over there underneath that solar panel. We need to check that out. They will after. But let me see if I can zoom in on it. solar I don't want to go down there right now I want to do the full you know show you guys what is the jewels that are being held in here you know that's really cool so you can just by yourself or with friends or with kids or your family you know just come and hang out and enjoy the natural 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 nothing artificial and eat and talk and hang out Pray, read a book, read a Bible, listen to music, you know, not blasting it, but you know what I mean? When I was a kid, well, and we call this wild rhubarb because it looks so much like the rhubarb plant. And when I was a kid, we just thought it was rhubarb. So we'd go in the fields and pick it. Oh, ooh, ooh. by the time you got a piece of that in your mouth it would get all full meat and it would be so bitter and then it's it's rhubarb's twin but oh my goodness well you learn you learn <laughs> quarry rocks Basically, no fireworks, no fires. They want to preserve it. They don't want it to burn down. It's for everyone. Enjoy it. Ad libbing, ad libbing. <laughs> but I'm trying. I'm trying. Look at that. Look at that. No excuse. If you can stand, crawl, march, walk, run, hike, think about doing it, praying first, and going doing it, there's a lot of free things that you can do. 
that you can do and still enjoy this beautiful weather. See, there's a, you know, you get tired or every so often you want to just rest. See, there it is. You can do it, you know? 15 minutes, 20 minutes, an hour, two hours, whatever you feel, what you have. Splice it up and spice it up. Do you. Now I'm still searching for that gold I'm telling you about. I'm telling you, you and I are gonna get some jokes. <laughs> but I'm gonna find it. If I have to make a part two for this, I'm gonna do it. Oh, look what I found. Not, not it though, just psyching you out. I can finally tell you what this is. Right? Can you see that? Can you see this? <laughs> Actually, this is just the map. This is what we're at, Legion. Okay. So you can see how huge this place is. If you want to learn about this beautiful nature park, go online to here. Park Frederic Park and learn all about it and come visit, come visit. Vous êtes dans le boisé. Come visit. Oh, that is awesome. You're probably wondering why I'm not sad that I haven't found the surprise I had for you today. Because I'm gonna continue this to number two because it's so long because I still gotta hit the other side of the sanctuary. But when I hit the other side, I'm gonna be with something else. Is that a clue? You'll figure it out. Because this sanctuary, it's huge. It's huge, it's huge. So I'm not sad that I haven't found what I was looking for today. I'm actually happy that we got to see this half and I did it on foot. There's another clue. But when I continue part two, I, well, it, it, it would be on something else. <laughs> so, no, I'm not sad. I'm actually happy. It's, uh, it's been a great hike. It's not done yet. It's not done yet. And I'm gonna give you that surprise. But uh, did you go get something to drink? Did you get something to eat? You should be out here with me. Mm-hmm. Searching for this, this surprise. You should be outside with me. But I'm gonna find it for you. Let's continue. Maybe I can find the bird, the part of the sanctuary that has the birds. Ooh, because I just seen a swallow. This is the one we call it. It goes whew, really fast, bye-bye. So don't be down. Stay with me, okay? All right, here we go. We're gonna continue on. We're gonna continue on. Whenever you see me go like this, I'm gonna go push the button. But that has some more to say. I go, shoot. No, <laughs> come on. <laughs> see, it doesn't matter. Young, middle age, old age, older, old age. If you wanna get out and just try, this is a place to come and try it out. It's peaceful. Only with noise that you get here are the birds chirping. Yes, and the planes fly by frequently but it's for a split second but you get you get the nature in and it, it's for all ages it's for all ages and look at the beauty of it look at the beauty look at that look at that you can run walk you can hike you know look at the beauty of the skies I told you I was a nature person. <laughs> Did you believe me? Well, it's true. It's true. I was kind of nervous to go down this way before. Oh, look, look. Okay, hold on. Let's see if I can zoom in. Let's see if I can zoom in. Can you see him? see him? He's right there. That's called a robin redbreast. That bird right there. I don't want to move because of, oh, because if I move, he's going to fly off. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I can't. Oh, 
these up in the tree, the other one. That one is, uh, this one here, Robin Redbreast. Okay, I'm gonna move, he's gonna fly off, but that's okay. He hasn't moved yet. He hasn't moved yet, people. Oh, there he goes, he's gone. That's okay, I got a nice shot of him checking himself. No, I'm looking for food. We call these here milkweeds. They get pods on them. And then you open them up. Some people, I've heard, eat them. This one kind of looks like a watermelon, this one. Yeah, that one looks like a watermelon. Hmm, let's check that out in a few weeks. See, that leads out here. And over there, you can see that ridge, the ridge behind? It's actually a hiking trail built higher up. All along that ridge, because people are over there running, hiking, riding bikes also, and just hanging out. And then you got the lower ridge, which is the sanctuary here, all across in the valley there. I was hoping to see some more birds. There's one right here, and he's got a beautiful color. Let me zoom in on him. See him? And he has red, black, and yellow on his wings. I was hoping he'd fly off. You can see. You can see the tip of the one of the colors. Ooh, there's an animal in there. I can hear it. What am I crazy? There's an animal in there. I just, I'm nervous to find out what it is. I'm getting ready to wiggle wobble away. <laughs> if I see it jump out, I'm gone. Where are you? I hear you. I better not stick my head in there too far. I can hear it. You know what? I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> You just stay where you are. I'm good. <laughs> yeah. I want to call it natural resources because I want to be exact on what they're pumping out. But, you know, it's either going to be gas or oil, right? So, 
I will not give a definite on what that is. That's what they're doing. They're pumping out natural minerals. Natural resources. But I'm telling you, they could make a space movie here and people would believe it that you were on a different planet. Because we still got the other half to do. But I'm still on my quest. I'm still on my journey to find the surprise. That's not it. That's not it. So, they have special events that go on here, like to tell about the natural mineral resources and whatnot, where you can just go online and learn more about it. Okay, but I won't give a definite saying it's gas, and I won't give a definite saying it's oil. One of the two, you know? That'll be me in a few days right there. That'll be me in a few days right there. Gotta get, gotta get the yep, yep, up, yep, lip, that'll be me, that'll be me. <laughs> I'm gonna find ya. And when I find ya, I'm gonna use you to get around because it's a lot easier than walking. How's that? Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, it's a bench. I thought it was. Yeah, it's a bench. Oh, Rose. You're so determined, Rose. Yes, I am. Man! Is this another hill? Okay, listen. I'm doing this to get in shape. I'm doing this to give you stuff to come on adventures with me so you'll come out with me. I'm doing this because it's fun. But when I hit these hills, uh, uh, that's a joke. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna zigzag it because you know that if you zigzag up a hill, right? It's easier than walking straight up a hill. If you zigzag, it's easier than walking straight up. Hey! This is the old train line. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. You know what that means, right? I'm gonna have to go find the history of how long ago this train ran through this natural sanctuary, nature sanctuary. Ha! Huh? Go figure. So cool. So cool. We'll, we'll search for that later. What I'm going to look for now, and I'm, I will continue this video. And when I find it, I will bring us back to the other half. The other half. And I'll have more treats for you. But as for now, I, as for now, we'll keep on walking. We're going to keep on walking. We're going to keep on searching. Ooh, ooh. Yes, man. There's another... See that? Now my curiosity's been piqued. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, I made it up the hill, people. I distracted myself. I distracted you and I made it up the hill. Let's go turn around and look. See? See, we did it. We did it. We did it. Whew. What a view. What a view. Look at that sun. Ready? Look at that. Look at that. And yes, that's real. That's real. No Photoshop in there. That's real. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. My Perrier is almost done, though. I'm going to have to find another shop somewhere. Love the back of these buildings, uh, homes. I have to find another shop somewhere and uh, get some more water. But that's a long way off, so stay with me, stay with me. Look at that. That's the top of the buildings. You see all the wiring and whatnot? Hi. You wouldn't think that all that was up there. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Okay. So did you see how much exercise we did? Look at look at the sweat. Look at the sweat. Look at the sweat. Whoo wee. Whoo wee. You and I sweated and exercised today. Even though we didn't find our uh, our uh, surprise. It ain't over. It ain't. We just getting started. Okay? We will find it. We will get it. We will conquer it and we will I ain't going to tell you that last sentence because you're going to know what it is if you haven't figured it out yet. Oh, you see that? Because I'm standing in the middle of a walk lane, bike lane. Oh, well. Oh, well. 
All right, don't don't give up. Don't give up. I'm telling you, we burnt a lot of calories searching for this prize, this surprise. Man, but it feels good, even with these old joints. Hey, I'm feeling it, but I feel good. I'm out here. I'm out here. Oh, look at that tree. Look at that. I. We call those things we used to make. I'll have to show you another time. Uh, airplane propeller wings out of them. Yeah, it's weird. It's if, you, if you're trying to visualize it, but yeah. I'll show you next time. Whew. People getting their barbecues ready. Getting their picnics on. Enjoying this beautiful weather. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Oh. Man. Every time I got around the corner or something, around one of the trails, I'm like, yes. One's going to be here. Yeah, I know. But I'll find it. I will find it. Hey. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful, beautiful day. Thank you, Jesus. Oh. Almost got ran over. I'm turning around, capturing and praising the Lord. And this man on a fast bike comes. I keep forgetting there's hills, right? So by the time they hit that hill, I better move or I'm going to be ran over. Ran over Rosie. Oh, thank you, Jesus, for this beauty. Mm. See, remember I was talking about the water fountains? Look at that. See if you got your water bottle and you just refill it here. Right? So I'm going to spend, spend, spend. And then you got your water fountains. And the city gives, or I'll, I'll say village. I hate saying city, but it's free. The village gives that free. You know what I mean? Save some money. Oh, what a beautiful dog. playing soccer yeah oh he's gorgeous look Ooh. gorgeous and there's messages all over See if I don't translate for you, if you can figure out what it says. I mean, we must always practice recycling, putting away the garbage, to, you know, to preserve our parks. Anywhere, just to pick it up and put it away. You know what I mean? Let me get out of your way. <laughs> so listen, I'm gonna head back now, down the other side and uh, keep searching for what I'm looking for, for your surprise and for another part of the adventure. And I thank you for taking along with me today. And I want you to watch, like, subscribe, and share, okay? If you're new to Rosie's Way, if you're new to the family, thank you. Ooh, it's kind of, can you see me? Can you see me? Let me get a better lighting there. Thank you. If you're a return subscriber, a return family member, thank you. Because remember, we're all one. Please share. Big me up, man. Let's get this channel boosted, right? So remember, part two's coming because I'm going to find that surprise and you're going to help me, okay? God bless. It was nice seeing you and I'll see you soon, all right? Don't forget me. Come back for part two. All right, bye.
Are you still here? I think I found it. Hold on. Wait, wait. I think I found it. One second. Let me turn the camera around. What do you think? You think this is it? Do you think this is it? Well, you need to come back for part two. Ha <laughs>